Hello, hello, all of you beautiful places. How's everybody doing? So before we get into today's video of our June thumbs up or thumbs down, which one will it be today? Well, you're going to have to wait until after the word to see if it's likes or dislikes. Well, I guess the video already told you, huh? But well, maybe we won't. We put just it in don't the title. know. That's right. Yeah. Well, hmm. So. As I told you in yesterday's video, or whether it was the day before, or whatever, the series I'm doing now are topical studies, which is going to give you many scriptures instead of just one. This one is going to be the first portion of our conduct as Christians, what the Bible says about our conduct as Christians. I have so many scriptures in this one that I don't want to do it all in one or else we'll be here all day long. So, the first one is Romans 6, 4, and that's D. It says we, so you can break down the scriptures by A, B, C, D. We should also walk in newness of life. That means our old behavior should be behind us, not still currently happening in our new saved, born again Yeah, you can't be life. like, oh, I love Jesus, and then go backstabbing people. Being, and then and living like, in sin. Yeah, you can't, that's just, that's not how it works. When Jesus comes into your heart, he takes over. The Holy Spirit takes over. Not a spirit, the Holy Spirit. Spirit takes over, and that will automatically produce the fruit of righteousness, joy, and all of those things. So that's how why the Bible says you'll know them by their fruit. Key. Very key. Romans 6, 11 through 13. And this is really long, but I'm going to just read through it fast, but you guys will take notes if you want to recap these. You can go look it up. Yeah. Um, so you should consider yourselves dead to sin and able to live for the glory of God through Christ Jesus. Do not let sin control the way you live. Do not give in to its lustful desires. Do not let any part of your body become a tool of wickedness to be used for sinning. Hmm. Instead, Give yourselves completely to God since you have been given new life and use your whole body as a tool to do what is right for the glory of God. That's pretty darn clear, I'd say. And I just remembered that no one should find fault with your ministry. Well, it'll come up. Yeah, Romans 12, it. Romans 12, 1 and through. And so, dear brothers and sisters, I plead with you to give your bodies to God. Let them be a living and holy sacrifice, the kind he will accept. Do not copy the behaviors and customs of this world. We are not of this world. Do not. It means you don't act like every other person on YouTube who's stabbing each other in the back. You are supposed to be set apart and different. But let God transform you into a new person by changing the way you think. Then you will know what God wants you to do, and you will know how good and pleasing His perfect will really is. 2 Corinthians 6 3. We try to live in such a way that no one will be hindered from finding the Lord by the way we act. And so no one can find fault with our ministry. Now, how many do you Christians do you know that really, truly live that way? It's like really, truly are like going, okay, Lord. I mean, I confess this over my life. I prayed it over my life, Lord. This is what I want. I want to, I pray that I will live in such a way that no one will find fault with my ministry, that no one would be hindered. And you know what? There are going to be people who come here and nitpick, but they're finding fault in a symptom is what they're doing. Like if I'm in pain and my, my voice can't be all, oh my gosh, thank oh my God, today we're talking about the word and the joy, 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 down the market. Oh, we're all going to have oh bad days, guys. You know, I'm and in pain all the time. And yeah. just because someone has a bad day and they're going around with this expression, I found fault with your yeah, ministry. Yeah, that, you that, can't, that, that's, that's not what the word is talking that's about That's not here. what it's talking about. Mm -hmm. When they say when... 
like no one should find fault with your ministry you shouldn't be sleeping shouldn't around be with other people sin in your life like if you're married then and if you're cheating that's kind of like that's an example right. that's what they mean that we shouldn't find fault you in can't the be married separated living with another person and call yourself a christian period end of story that's you what can't that, means. that is blatant sin separation the bible is very clear you must be given a legal document of certificate of divorce the bible says it, it the bible covers everything it covers everything we need to know this is a, not our words the it's bible the word words. that's right don't attack us so for that. romans 13 13 and 14 we should be decent and true in everything we do so that everyone can approve of our behavior. Don't participate in wild parties. Mm-hmm. And getting drunk. Mm-hmm. Or in adultery. Mm-hmm. And immoral living. Mm-hmm. In fighting. Mm-hmm. And jealousy. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know why that was coming out of me, but it was. But hello. We shouldn't look at each other and be like, well, you got all this makeup and look at, you know, God just must love you or you, your family must be Everybody rich. Everybody gets blessed oh in different gosh, ways. Oh my gosh, that's right. God blesses you in different ways. It and could me, be with someone, he bringing you someone to be friends with. It could be like right. her makeup that, you know, it's like everybody's. And everybody's I've said different. this many times if you've been on my channel for any amount of time. I have a lot of makeup because this is all my life is able to be focused on right now because I'm in bed six days a week, sometimes seven. And this is all I can do right now. This is all I can do. And trust me, if I was up having a normal life, the last thing I'd be spending my money on is a bunch of makeup. she didn't even do that before. I didn't do it before. She, and I wouldn't yeah. do it even if I had a YouTube channel. I would be doing jewelry. I would be doing interior design. I would be doing DIY. I'd be doing other things that are more who I am. I am doing this because this is all I can do right now. Physically, it's all I can do. And I can barely keep up with this. So everybody wants to judge and be critical and be like oh this and that but you know what i'm blessed also because i'm a giver and i live it i don't visit it because i it, live it it reap what you i mean you, you reap, reap what, what you, you sow so like when yeah it's really self-explanatory if again if you want to nitpick at little things then go ahead then you need to check your heart if you're gonna right. go and do that because... and it's sad because anybody who goes around nitpicking other people has already got something in their heart that they need to uh, yeah. they need to look at and they do and, it, and when i find myself in a position where i'm being harsh about something i see and i i have the urge to do it i think okay what's really going on in me that makes me want to lash out at this person right now exactly. and then i go okay no i'm not gonna do it and i choose life and I'm not, I really don't want to come across as I'm being perfect or anything like that because I find myself judging people too. It's, mm -hmm. that's just, it's that's easy to fall what into. we do as humans is we judge and that's a, that's something we all, everybody in the world needs to work on is judge, being judgmental. So right. I certainly need to work on that. So I'm admitting that I need to work on it. Right. And the, the verse 14 of Romans 13 is. But let the Lord Jesus Christ take control of you and don't think of ways to indulge your evil desires. We all can think about that, like sit around thinking, ooh, how could I do, how could I get this? How could I do, I, and it's all flesh. But the last one, I'm going to finish this one and then we'll move on. First Timothy 4 verse 12, don't let anyone think less of you because you are young. Be an example to all believers in what you teach, in the way you live, in your love, your faith, and your purity. That means you're supposed to have purity in your heart. You can't l be you can't an example lusting. in it when you're going and having lusting extramarital affairs Yes, or, or other people's husbands or wives whatever you have to be living in purity in god's eyes and it's not according to what pamela considers purity because i'm sharing this with you it's what the word says i'm simply sharing what the word says i didn't write this i don't want to take responsibility for it because i know i would get my booty kicked in a minute being sick mm -hmm. as i am but it's what the word says i'm just sharing it with you but i think many people go well, I don't know if the Bible really tells us how we're supposed to be living. You and it's like, well, then you're not then. reading it then. Yeah. yeah, you are 
you're not picking it up and reading it. Or you have real selective looking or something. You want to go to the scriptures you want to hear. That are about being blessed and prosperous. Go into Psalms, you know, or Proverbs and things like that. You got to get into the kick your butt, like Romans, Hebrews, Jude. Yeah, not saying there's anything wrong with Psalms. Please don't. No, it's one of my favorites. I love going to Psalms when I want to feel good. So Yeah, absolutely. (laughs) Or when you're getting attacked and you're like, Lord, I feel like David. You know, yes. I'm admitting I do that. So, you know, like... Yeah. So are we going to do our, our, we're going to get into this, but I've got so much more to share in that and that will well, be in the next video. Be a separate video because we're at 10 minutes. Nope. No? We're going to just okay. go through likes is smaller. So let's do likes. Okay. Likes is smaller. We have more dislikes than this one. Actually, I, I'm pretty close to equal, but I did do a little bit Yeah, I have, we smaller have, version we today. we both have? Sure. We both have this. And I'm telling you. Y'all know I had to include mm, a lip balm. Mm, this mm, is mm. this is the Tarte Sugar Rush lip balm. It's only twelve oh. bucks. Honestly, I think it's so worth it because look at the packaging. I want this it. in a gigantic size. But I first of all, I love the packaging. And what I I've already decided what I'm doing, and I'm gonna do it now that I've done this video. Is I'm mm. scooping it all out and I'm putting it inside one of my little lip thingies because I hate using my nails. It gets under my nails. It ends up wasting it. Well, I just, I, but I'm like going to keep this little tube and put some of my loose, my own homemade loose highlighter in this. And that's what I'm going to use this for. But I love the packaging. I'll never get rid of this and packaging, but the l- balm it feels really nice amazing. and moisturizing and it smells like cotton candy. It is the, it my favorite. I love the scent. I don't know anybody who wouldn't like this I, scent because oh. it's, it's just a really nice scent and this moisturizes your lips. And again, it's 12 bucks and I think I that's do, honestly a really good I price. do kind of think that they could give us a little bit more for 12 bucks. I'm not going to lie because think I think, well, this, mm, I mean, I didn't get this that long I think ago. they could give us more, but that's just me. I think this could be a bigger size because you get lip balms in a tube for three bucks that are way more than comes in this little jar but you you get you pay more because of how cute this little jar is so mm-hmm. but i still love it and i will st- i paid full price for this bad boy and, and i never one. pay full price for anything no she thing. bought this for me i'm not like, kidding you paid full price i paid full price and i would do it again because it is my favorite and I keep it on display. Ever. If you guys follow me on Instagram, I'm sure you've seen this in the background of my photos. I keep this on my desk. I love it. My next thing is because when you guys see my dislikes video, you're going to crack up because my dislikes are one of the, these products. But this is the Juice Beauty. And that's going to give a big thing away about my my dislikes. But this is the only Juice Beauty product I like. The only one. And it is the Green Apple Firming Body Moisturizer. Oh my gosh, you guys. This is to live for good. This is what it looks like. Um, I It's very it's hard to see. Yeah, that's it's overexposed. That's why it's... But um, this stuff makes you so hydrated. It, it feels like it really deals with cellulite. Because, look, I'm bedridden a lot, you guys. I don't. I used to have such good muscle tone in my legs. Now I have like zero muscle tone in my legs. And this is helping with the cellulite that I deal with because I'm bedridden so much. I have not been using this more than two weeks and I see a noticeable difference in that amount of time and I've never used anything that's done it. And it hydrates your legs for like three days. You do not have to put like it on after on after on like other other lotions that your legs will look dry later. This stuff is amazing and it's $12. I got it. I think that was on sale, but um, I don't know how much it is, but I'm telling you, Next time, if this is if twelve was the sale price, I'm going to get a couple when it's on sale because I'm hooked on this. I love it, love it. So since she's talking about a cream, I'm going to talk about this cream that I'm absolutely in love with. This is Vitamin K Cream by Piping, Piping Rock. Rock. That's P I P I N G O. And you can only I'm get sure it on PipingRock.com. Yes. They are an essential oil company. They are a company I get a lot of my essential oils from. Just a white cream. They're a really pretty good. They used to be really super great, but then they started getting really greedy and their prices went like through the roof. And that's when I stopped spending my money with them because 
at first they were really fair and I love the product but you can get things like this this, this skin cream's only like five dollars yeah she has um like a cabinet shelf full of these and I was like can I use it like it's been sitting there for a mm -hmm. while and I just started using it and I looked up what vitamin K is because I never hear vitamin K in like anything Products. and it helps with redness it helps with varicose veins it's amazing. if you have that and honestly this had, has helped with my redness so much and it doesn't sit on your skin it doesn't break her out it like sinks into my skin immediately and it does not have a scent it's just a plain you know smells like a cream these are the creams I buy and use when I make mm -hmm. my own facial blends that's all organic that makes I use essential oils and that vitamin K cream to do my own blend of when I want to treat my skin. And let me tell you, I had really good results from people who were buying it at the time. And then I got really sick and I stopped making it. But I literally made a blend once and put it on and my mom's, the wrinkles around her lip went away and on her eyes, like right before our eyes. And she was like, oh my gosh, like she, if she didn't see it, she wouldn't have believed it. All of us sat and watched it happen. But I haven't made it in a long time because I've been so sick. But I was going to literally start selling it. But and, um, um, this has some really good stuff in it too. Like the second ingredient is aloe vera. There's some sunflower extract. There's vitamin K. There's cucumber extract. There's wild Mexican yam extract. Royal jelly extract. Yeah. Manuka honey. Yeah, it's got great stuff in it. It has really good stuff in it. But that's just the good things in it. But, okay, so yes, since we're doing lotions, I don't know if I did this in my other video, but let me tell you, I got this in my FabFitFun add-ons, and this is called oh, Cali EE. I, this is smooth as butter, body butter, brown sugar. Okay, it does not smell does like brown sugar to like me that. at all. Um, it doesn't really smell like It much. just smells like a lotion, like a light, um, kind of a, it's, this thing is, it's this white cream. It this, looks like the um the bum bum cream, the coconut blue one or whatever. Yeah, it looks Has like it colored the same yeah. texture and everything, but it doesn't have the stickiness. Mm -hmm. This goes in and it gives your legs like such an amazing glow. Your arms, anything you put it on, like a, such a hydrated, healthy looking glow. And again, it feels like it helps with um the cellulite, other things on your in in on your legs that you deal with, and I just have never found anything. This was eleven dollars when I got it at FabFitFun, so I imagine it's pretty expensive. But I don't know what the retail price is. But I'm not kidding. I I recommend this more than I recommend Bum Bum Cream. I think this blows I like the way that feels blows Bum Bum Cream out of the water and I kind out of like of that it doesn't have a scent because then it doesn't clash with, with my your perfume, perfume or anything like that Love so it. the next thing I'm just going to talk about these two at once I have the floss box and if you watch the June fav or just our favorites video this was in it this is a really amazing non-sticky hydrating lip gloss that's only 16 bucks I totally recommend it if you well, want to get it. Well, it wasn't our June it was just some favorites we had yeah. it was kind of more like May favorites but and then I have the Fenty Beauty Gloss. This Which, is just honestly my favorite, favorite gloss. Yeah, I want to get the other one, but this is the best gloss I've ever tried, so I recommend it. My next favorite is this bad boy right here. Oh my gosh, I'm not kidding. I love this. I think I got this for free with my points, right? Um, I don't Quite know. a while ago. I'm pretty sure I did at Ulta, and it was a while back. I'm telling you, I never, I don't understand how people say they have a problem with Tarte Shadows, but I have never had a problem with their shadows. They're one of my favorite brands to use. I love this. I don't, I'm not, not going to lie, I'm not a big fan of the glitters. But the formula and how these shadows go on, I am wearing this color of the teal below my eyes today. It is my favorite color teal shadow. I cannot wait to just do an all over blue smoky eye with that. I mean, it's gorgeous, but I mean, you barely put any on a brush and just boom, boom, boom. And it just whammo gives you gorgeous color that blends so seam seamlessly and it just seems like the more you just keep spreading it, it just keeps getting richer and richer. And it's just like a 
amazing. I love the um, matte formulas. I honestly did not think I was going to love this palette because of the glitter in it. And now this is turning out to be one of my faves because of the formula and how beautifully it goes on. But love it. Love it. I'm going to do these two. I have the Fourth Ray Beauty Watermelon Face Milk. This is ColourPop Skincare Line. This is their watermelon. I think I just said that. This just came out recently and I got it on my birthday, which is June 7th. And as you can see, I'm literally almost out of it. This one, I honestly really love this stuff. I have noticed that my face is more glowy and looks way better. The only downside to me is it needs to be a little bit bigger. I think one, very small size. I think 50, 0 0.50 fluid ounces is honestly just way too little. Um, but I, I honestly agree. love this and I have pretty sensitive skin and acne prone skin. And this is really good. They put stuff. it in a smaller jar and make you think you're getting such a great deal. But when you put it up to a full size jar, you're really paying the high end and price. This is $10. My, she got it in a kit. It. on sale and this also came in the kit and this is the watermelon lip scrub which honestly if you are a lip scrub gal and does that every day I swear you need to get their lip scrub because it's honestly one of the best lip scrubs in a jar oh, it ever smells like fruit. I use I it after it. I do my elf elf one and I I love this so I totally recommend those two so my next favorite is the Juvia's Place Loose Highlighter. Oh my goodness. She got this for herself. And then it, it was too dark. Thought it was for too me. dark for her. And then she goes, Mom, this will look amazing on you. And I put it on and she was like, Oh my gosh, Mom, that looks amazing on you. I love this. And I actually, I don't know if the video is, I don't think the video is up yet, but I just did a video of all this free stuff I got from Ulta. And I haven't I didn't think I had all the stuff when I went and checked my account after I realized I have a whole nother box of free stuff that I got coming from Ulta that hasn't arrived, doesn't get here till Wednesday. And I got another loose, Juvia's Place loose highlighter. I'm so excited because I'm they so into highlights out. right now. But this, I love this it's highlight. It's an amazing highlight. You barely don't yes, need you just any. You barely just touch it, it and it's it goes like, on. It's honestly amazing. Gorgeous love it i recommend it i love that it's loose i love it loose and um i would recommend this to everybody beautiful so did you want to go nope you go because i'm going to talk about the alamar cosmetics i had talked about this in the favorites video but this palette is honestly amazing and thank you andrea cole for trading my mom because i honestly love it i'm wearing it on my cheeks today this is like the best blush palette i've ever tried and her formula is just amazing like go alamar i love her stuff and i want to try more of her stuff i'm Me waiting too. i'm waiting for some highlighters though girl i think she's Come gonna on, have I know. some bring amazing it. Bring highlighters it. So. i cannot wait for those either and this is light and honestly it works perfectly for me so I and that would be this. in my favorites too but i didn't add it because i had it in the last one so i didn't want to repeat it so i i only pick things that are like i didn't I do didn't have prior any, so, so sorry so my last item which i got this i believe it was our um allure box right yeah is this brow gal okay this to me is revolutionary for someone like me because i have like many little girl eyebrows i literally have the eyebrows of a little girl and i mean there are some little girls that have thicker eyebrows than me like this girl I seriously have puny, puny eyebrows, and then because of the lupus, I don't know if a lot of you know, but hair loss is part of lupus, I can be cleaning my face and just wiping my skin with a towel, and my eyebrows will wash right off, like in a big chunk. I'm missing a huge chunk right here, right now, but I'm astonished at how this tends to I, add lack eyebrows that you don't have and i'm still trying to figure out how it does it i really like it it's like i swear one time i was like is there many hairs in i here? know because i, I swear was like, i thought it was creating? adding hairs to my hair to my eyebrows and mine my wand broke that's the downside of this it has a really you have to be really thin really wand. gentle she's heavy-handed and i am too but I, since i know how fragile this is i'm super delicate with it because i love this and i don't want it to break but it's I will forever product. 
use this because I am sold and I'm so grateful to have gotten this in my lower box to have because I would have never so went out and selected something like this. I was using a pencil and I I'm just like I can't tell you if you have small eyebrows like me, like it just gives my I eyebrows just recommend, such life. and I think it's like around twenty or something and I, I right. honestly think it's worth the price. It's I mean, a really Yes, I would pay that without a not, doubt because it does so well. Don't get it mixed with a brow gel because it doesn't hold your brows in place, but it's more like a tint type of a thing. But I still recommend it. It's awesome. And I didn't think it would work because it says brown hair and I absolutely love the Just color. Just go in really light handed so if you have love it. Yeah. It's amazing. I love it too. But that's all of our favorites. That's our favorites, guys. But you guys are our favorites. You that come and show yourself so faithful to my yes, channel. Thank We're you for so the OGs. We're so grateful for you guys. Yes. The people who come. Love the OJs and the ODs or, or the OGs. The dudes. Oh, dudes. oh, I was like, All dudes. don't say OGs. Well, you can't call them OGs, too, because they're not gals. Well, so yeah. the ODs and the OGs, thank you for all of your support. The owns, the owns. And if you're the NGs, the new gals, then just hit that subscribe button and give us a like if you like the video. I would so appreciate it. We love you guys so much and thank you for taking your precious time to come watch yes, us thank you. talk about our favorite product. We love you and we pray that God keeps you safe. Bye. Bye. Bye.